Florida State and Clemson are battling in public. Mike Norvell, Florida State football coach, fired back at Dabo Sweeney. Dabo came out and said, look, we had one asymptomatic positive backup offensive lineman who was uh, who was identified and was not going to play three hours before the game is set to be played. The ACC is fine with it going on. FSU says no. And so as a result, are they actually going to play this game? Now, this is different than what has happened many other games that have been canceled days in advance. I'm not aware of any major college football game or any major sport in general that has been canceled on the day of the game after some people from the team have already gone to the football stadium to get ready for that game. Uh, What we have to do, and we still haven't been able to do it even as we approach Thanksgiving, is behave rationally in regards to this virus and what restrictions there are to put in place. Guys, I don't know if you saw this, But the state of Pennsylvania has announced an alcohol sales restriction uh, beginning on Wednesday going all the way through Thanksgiving. I don't know what in the world they are trying to uh, actually manage with this alcohol sales restriction. The city of LA shut down all restaurant dining. That's despite the fact that many restaurants in LA spent tons of money to try to set up outdoor seating areas so they could remain viable. So not only has LA shut down all indoor dining, but after allowing all of these struggling businesses to spend tons of money on outdoor seating options, now the city of Los Angeles has shut down everything. This is madness. This is COVID hysteria run amok. None of it makes sense from a logical perspective. This is what I told you from the get-go. Everybody is competing to try to be the most anti-COVID politician on the planet. And as a result, they're making all sorts of irrational decisions that are not supported in any way by basic logical fact or truth. This is a major, major issue, I believe, going forward. And the fact that we have politicians behaving in such ignorant and insanely dumb uh, ways is, to me, a real major issue in the country that is not getting resolved in any way. In fact, arguably, it's getting worse.